Hi, I'm Paul Psolka, Ivy Masters Learning Center and ivymasters.com. Today we're going to look at test one, section two, number 37, which reads, which choice most effectively sets up the information that follows? So when you're considering these types of answers, see if you'd expect something before or after. <clears throat> and I know it says sets up the information that follows, so we do want to pay attention to what comes after. Give that your top priority. But what I found is you got to take into consideration the transition before and after. So regardless, whenever it's asking you a question question like this, consider both transitions. Sometimes the, the transition opposite to what they're talking about is actually more helpful. So answer choice A says, consequently, philosophy students have been receiving an increasing number of job offers. So consequently means as a result, what I'm expecting after that is philosophy students having job offers. What's it say after that? 1994 survey concluded that only 18% of American colleges required at least one philosophy course. So it's talking about philosophy not being required by universities very often it has nothing to do with job offers. Answer choice B. Therefore, because of the evidence, colleges increase their offerings of philosophy. We see the opposite, um, pretty much the opposite. Only 18% of American colleges require it. So there's not a lot of philosophy in schools. Answer choice C, notwithstanding the attractiveness of this course of study, students have resisted majoring in philosophy. This, this sentence here is not focusing on students resisting, it's focusing on how many colleges offer it. So that's out as well. So the correct answer is gonna be D. However, despite its many utilitarian benefits, colleges have not always supported the study of philosophy and then only 8%, 18% of universities offer it or colleges offer it. And notice the transition before as well, what I was talking about before. Before it says, because philosophy teaches students not what to think, but how to think, the age old discipline offers consistently useful tools for academic and professional achievement. That sounds good. And then you have your transition, however, despite it's many utilitarian benefits, it's useful benefits that were mentioned before. Um, colleges have not always supported it and then only 18% of colleges offer it. Thank you for joining us today. If you like this video, click like. You can share it with someone who has trouble um, sequencing within these section two writing and language questions. If there's any question you'd like to see answered from any official PSAT or SAT or ACT, leave that in the comments. I'd be happy to shoot a video on it and click subscribe so you don't miss anything. Have a great day.